Okay, so one very good question is asked by Dr. Jaiswal, and he is asking that when we transfuse the red blood cells in a patient, so after that transfusion, after how much time we should check the hemoglobin so that the values comes correct. So understand that whenever we transfuse uh, red blood cells in a patient uh, who is non-bleeding, the hemoglobin tends to reach a particular equilibrium state and it takes certain time. So how much time? So there was one study in 2020 in which they compared the hemoglobin values after one hour of transfusion, four hours of transfusion and 24 hours of the transfusion. And that and they found that all the values are uh, correct. I means the values tested after one hour is uh, matching with the value which is uh, tested after 24 hours. So we can test the hemoglobin uh, value after one hour. But there are various studies. There are various studies which confirm that or which come to the conclusion that the hemoglobin value tested after 15 minutes in a non-bleeding patient is as good as is almost accurate if we compare the value after 24 hours. So if you transfuse uh, uh, PEG red blood cells in a patient who is not bleeding, you can test it after 15 minutes of the stoppage of the transfusion. Obviously, in a bleeding patient, the scenario is different because there is an ongoing loss. You need to measure much. Uh, you need to measure based on the situation of the patient. Uh, we test immediately, usually after transfusion. So I hope this clarifies. Do read more about it.